Welcome to a unique and hopefully very interesting video. My buddy Ivan lives out in Colorado and is a river fishing guide. He and his company produce these drift boats. This is the Colorado, the high side, and they're also working on a southern boat, which would be a lower sidewall boat, hopefully for marketing the marsh and, and the areas down here around Louisiana. Anyhow, beautiful boat, very well made. All the information will be in the description, including a link to his website, smartflyfish.com. Hope you enjoy this video. There'll be a lot of in information and dialogue in the video itself. Thanks a lot for watching, and please hit me with any comments, suggestions, questions you have about this boat. We'll be sending out more videos soon. Thanks for watching. All right, good morning, fellas. We got Captain Ivan Perrin, the front of the boat. The Colorado, his prototype, his boat, does some river fishing out in Colorado. We're gonna see if this thing doesn't dominate the swamps and the marsh and mainly the cove of Sippamore Point this morning. We're early, right, Captain? We are early. We're a little bit early, and uh, Michelle, I don't think there's anybody that's ever seen a drift boat on a Sippamore Point now. Take a look at this drift uh -uh. boat. Some beautiful wooden oars. We are gonna get some trout. I think the trout are gonna like those oars. I think so, too. All right, let's go get them. Bon chance. Very cool process. He's got rollers on his trailer. And then he can pull that boat up and back by himself. You see later how he gets back up on there by itself. All right, never have I felt lazier, but man, Ivan knows how to work this boat. Rowing, smooth as could be. All right, Quintana Canal. Oh, son, here we go. Got our first Colorado boat trout. We gotta get him up. First saltwater fish. Way to go, Captain Ivan. There you go. It was a quick paddle right up into the cove, and we were both able to catch some nice trout right away, drifting and anchored some as well. Nicely done, sir. Got you a keeper. There you go. You're getting right out where you were, okay? He uh, swallowed it, huh? Yeah, he did. Well done. Let's see if that's 12 inches. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's 12 right there. Okay, dude. Got a better one here, a little bit better. Mm. It is. Woo. Number three. Come on, Captain. Right as you asked if we liked it here. Yep. We like it here. Get him up there. There we go, son. Ah. What do you think about that, Gumbo? Yeah, baby. That's what you want. Captain Ivan put me in that fish's mouth. There you go. Amen. Hallelujah. Let's go. Hammer time. That's it. We right, spotted well, him move too, baby. Well, I haven't called that one. I said right there, one o'clock. Well done, let's do it again. Okay. So this boat is obviously very stable, very quiet, plenty of space, three nice seats, platforms in front and back for standing and sight fishing, and even space for Gumbo the dog. Very, very comfortable boat. Plenty of space to move around. Yeah, it is. All right, son. It's a heavier one. It was just the dog and the two of us on this day, but the boat easily handles three people, and the guide has plenty of space to sit and maneuver around. It's actually quite functional. You can navigate through very narrow areas and those oars are easy to handle. You can even do some trolling with the guide sliding you along. Quite neat all the way around. We only spent about half a day. We're able to move around the cove quite nicely and ended up with 13 very good keepers on what was a slow day for most folks out there. We did extremely well. All right, we are heading back in. Cruising down the Quintana Canal from the cove at Sippamore Point, Louisiana. Captain Ivan doing an epic job, but this gives you a sense of how smooth and fast this boat is. You take a look at these oars and how well made that is. It's got a little flex to it and the perfect size paddle. Made out of cypress, one piece. Cypress, these one are piece. Single piece, no laminate, hand carved by Larry McIntyre. Wow. 
And look at this. Look how quickly. Southern Wood Paddle Company. Look how quickly we are moving along these rocks. You can look at these oars on smartflyfish.com. All right. And again, quiet enough and smooth enough to where you can hear and see anything that's going on in case there's some, some fish activity. Beautiful day. Thanks for the ride, Captain Ivan. Thank you for the ride and the fishing spot. All right. Just a pin up angler. <laughs> Goodbye, Sippamore Point for now. All right, we have landed. And Captain Ivan's about to pull the anchor up. It's got a great anchor system there. Two catches. And uh, you can see it back here. Really easy to handle that boat. That's just a 15 pound anchor. Beautiful view of the boat here with the captain's seat right in the middle there and the anchor line between his legs on the floor. Easy to connect right, and disconnect. You can see this part of the process. Put that boat up. One man job. Couldn't be better. Too easy. Yep. The rollers on that trailer and the way the boat's designed allows for, of course, one man easy and access to a lot of places where you can launch and then get that boat back out. There you go. Excellent. Pulling that with a Jeep Laredo. Smooth as can be. how easily everything stores in the boat so efficient got these beautiful seats made with rope for the seating it's very comfortable it's dry it's, it's cool. airy cool very cool and then you've got these boxes for storage built in to the seats you got support platforms you can even sight fish up off of those things I had the front today and it was glorious great padding all throughout the boat for your feet can't tell you how good that felt on the bare foot we got a bag of nice trout right there and actually we have her a little messy right now but this boat is mess free I mean it is really cool how you can lay all your gear down and everything's out of the way and you can get it done in terms of some good quality fishing the Colorado high side Coming out soon on smartflyfish.com. Smartflyfish.com. I'm going to put that link in the description. All right. Thanks again to Captain Ivan. This was an awesome, awesome day. What a, hey. woo, what a boat. As always, thanks a lot for watching. I know this is a unique video. You can contact Ivan directly through smartflyfish.com. Again, the link will be in the description. And we're going to be doing some marsh fishing and some red fishing, hopefully some sight fishing out of this thing very soon. More videos and more information on the boat to come. Thanks again, and I'll see you out on the water soon, I hope.